Hello all, welcome back. Um, so last uh, video we covered how to build a base and how to build a structure. Okay, this video I'll cover how to install the roof and walls. So you can see the the left side wall and the right side wall is really easy because it's just a rectangle shape so that's very easy to install just uh, put some nails or screws in that's very easy the, the difficult part relatively difficult part is about um, how to install it uh, on the front so as you can see in the menu it, it tells you very clearly you need to put a board right so in front of the skeleton the, the framework here and they use your pencil to cut out the piece that you don't want and also here this is uh, saved for the doors um, I used a clamp because uh, at the time when I did this um, I'm just doing it uh, alone and it, you know um, so I used a clamp so once the board is in I clamped it so that the board and the framework stick together so in that time I can just mark them I mark everything and then I put this board with the mark on the floor and then I use my circular saw to cut it to the exact shape okay so you repeat the whole process to the front um, once you did the front you did you will do the the back side so that's finishing the uh, the wall installation the next step you do is you install the roofs. Uh, the one thing I learned, um, what I recommend is um, you need to stick your roof a little bit out. And this is kind of common sense. Um, we, I didn't see this in the menu. It looks like in the menu, is nothing stick out, right? So it's like uh, exactly nothing, it was two or three inches here, it's not there. Uh, if that's the case, you know, the water will flow through, you know, the walls, right? So that's not very good for the, um, for the water resistance purpose. So I use the common sense to make it a little longer. See the left side, the right side. Okay. And also the, the front and the back, right? So that's uh, important. Once you have all of that, you don't maybe you have to work from Monday to Friday and um, you'll probably do some work in the next week so I just use uh, vapor rate the vapor barrier to cover everything okay so just uh, prevent the water from uh, getting in as I mentioned in my previous video you really don't want water get into your interiors and this create all sorts of mess okay so make sure you cover that and watch the weather okay when the weather is good take take a good opportunity of that even if you do it uh, after work or even a couple of hours right so that's I that's why I think uh, the fall is probably the best time and then you have uh, still sunset maybe around 8 p.m. Or, or 7 p.m. but in the winter not a good idea right in the winter the sunset is maybe five or six so you, you don't really have time to work on this project so really uh, I encourage you to do this in in this fall and um, so the weather is helping you okay so this is a short video and uh, install the roof and wall the next video will cover mostly the um, you know the the vinyl siding the drip edge the ventilation the roof shingles all, all of these things are talking about like waterproofing your shed okay well thank you for watching we'll see you in my next video bye